Hello friends, I am Santosh. Welcome to online studification. Friends, from past few days I couldn't make any videos due to some health issues. From now I will be posting at least one video daily related to banking and SSE exams. So to get notified with my videos, do subscribe my channel and also please do share the video. Okay, let's begin with today's session. In this video we will see some important techniques to simplify problems in faster way. Okay. First we shall see how to divide any of the numbers by 5. Okay. We shall take an example of 37. Okay. We shall take an example of 37 divided by 5. Okay. So how to proceed with this type of uh, example? This 37 should be multiplied with 2. Okay. So what you will get if you multiply by 2? You will get 74. Okay. And this 74 should be divided by 10. Okay, so what you will get 7.4 that is 37 divided by 5 is 7.4. Okay, so we shall take one more example. We shall take an example of 253. Okay, we shall take an example of 253 divided by 5. Okay, so how to proceed with this? Uh, first we have to multiply this 253 with 2. Okay, so what you will get 6 and this is 10 and 2, 4, 1, 5, not 6, okay. And this 5, not 6 should be divided by 10, okay. In this case, what you will get? 50.6, okay. I hope you understood this. We shall take one more example. We shall take an example of 1013 divided by 5, okay. So, how to proceed with this? 1013 should be multiplied with 2, okay. So, what you will get if you multiply? You will get 2026, okay. And final step, what we have to do? Can you tell me? We have to multi, uh, we have to divide by 10. Okay, so what you will get 202.6. Okay, that is 1013 divided by 5 is 202.6. Okay, we shall take one more set of examples. In this set of examples, we shall divide numbers by 25. Okay, we shall take an example of 67 divided by 25. Okay, so how to proceed with this? Just multiply this 67 with 4 okay so what you will get if you multiply with 4 you will get 268 okay you will get 268 and this 268 should be divided by 100 okay so what you will get 2.68 what we have done here we are dividing 67 by 25 in this case what we have to do just multiply this 67 with 4 okay and you will get 268 and this 268 should be divided by 100 and you will get 2.68 Okay, we shall take one more example. We shall take an example of 139 divided by 25. Okay, so how to proceed with this? This 139 should be multiplied with 4. Okay, if you multiply with 4, what you will get? 4 9s are 36, 3, 4 3s are 12, 12, 3, 15, and 1 carry forward, 4 1s are 4, 4 plus 1, 5. Okay, you will get 556. And this 556 should be divided by 100. Okay, so finally what we will get? 5.56. Okay, so 139 divided by 25 is 5.56. Okay, I hope you understood this. We shall take one more example. We shall take an example of 1079 divided by 25. So, how to proceed? This 1079 should be multiplied with 4. Okay, in this case, what you will get? You will get 6 and 1, 3, 4. Okay, 4, 3, 1, 6 will get and divided by 100. So, what you will get? 43.16. Okay, I hope you understood this. So, what is 1079 divided by 25? It is 43.16. Okay, we shall take next set of examples. In this set of examples, we shall divide numbers by 125. Okay, we shall take an example of 83 divided by 125. Okay, so how to proceed with this? What we have to do? 83 should be multiplied with 8. Okay, so what we will get? 83 is a 24 to carry forward. 8 is a 64, 64, 66. Okay, you will get 664. And this 664 should be divided by 100. So, what you will get? 6 point. Uh, sorry, you have to divide it by 1000. So, what you will get? 0. 0.664. Okay, so what is 83 divided by 125? It is 0. 0.664. Okay, we shall take one more example. We shall take an example of 729 divided by 125. Okay, and this 729 should be multiplied with 8. So, what you will get if you multiply? You will get 2, 3, 8 and this is 5. Okay, you will get 5, 8, 3, 2 and you have to divide it by 1000. So, what you will get? 
5.832. Okay, I hope you got this. We shall take one more example. We shall take an example of 3012 divided by 125. Okay, so how to proceed? Just multiply this 3012 with 8. Okay, so what you will get if you multiply with multiply with 8? 6 and this is 9 and 0, 4 and this is 2. So what you will get? 24096. Okay, and this 24096 should be divided by 1000. So what you will get? 24.096 okay that is 3012 divided by 125 24.096 okay i hope you understood all these techniques friends now we shall review the techniques that we have discussed till now okay so first what we have done we have taken one number and we have divided by and uh, we tried to divide by 5 okay so what we have done in this case uh, we have to multiply this number with 2 and some product we will get okay and this product should be divided by 10 and you will get your final answer okay and in next case what we have done while dividing by 25 we divide we multiplied that number with 4 okay and you got some product and this product we have divided by 100 okay and you got your final answer okay i hope you understanding these techniques okay so in final technique what we have discussed while dividing any of the numbers with 125 in this case uh, multiply this number with 8 okay and you will get some product and that product should be divided by 1000 okay and you will get your final answer okay i hope you understood these techniques friends now we shall take next set of examples in this set of examples we shall multiply numbers by 5 okay now multiply numbers with 5 okay we shall take an example of 47 into 5 okay so how to proceed with this uh, 47 should be divided by 2 okay so what you will get if you divide by 2 you will get 23.5 okay you will get 23.5 and this 23.5 should be multiplied with 10 so what you will get 235 okay i hope you understood this what we have done here we have to multiply this 47 with 5 okay so first step what we have done just divide this 47 by 2 okay and you will get some uh, some answer here okay and this value should be multiplied with 10 okay and you will get your final answer okay i hope you understood this we shall take one more example we shall take an example of 861 into 5 so what is first step can you tell me 861 should be divided by 2 okay so what you will get 430.5 okay 430.5 and this 430.5 should be multiplied with 10 okay so what you will get 430 and this is 5 okay i hope you understood this okay we shall take one more example we shall take an example of we shall take an example of 1227 into 5 okay so how to proceed this 1227 should be divided by 2 okay so what you will get if you divide by 2 this is 6 and this is 1 and this is 3 and this is 0.5 okay so what we got 613.5 and this this should be multiplied with 10 so what you will get 63 613 and this is 5 okay so 1227 into 5 is 613 5 i hope you understood this set of examples okay now we shall multiply numbers with 25 okay we shall take an example of 93 into 25 so how to proceed in this case what we have to do divide this 93 by 4 okay so what you will get if you divide by divide it by 4 you will get 2 this is 3 and point 0.2 okay point 0.2 and this is 5 okay so what we will get 23.25 and this 23.25 should be multiplied with 100 so finally what you will get 2, 3, 2, 5. That is 93 into 25 is 2, 3, 2, 5. Okay. I hope you understood this. We shall take one more example. We shall take an example of 762 into 25. So, how to proceed? This 762 should be divided by 4. Okay. So, what you will get if you divide it by 4? You will get, you will get 1, this is 9, 90.5 okay so you will get 190.5 and this 190.5 should be multiplied with 100 so finally what you will get 190 and this is 5 and again one more zero okay that is 762 into 25 is 19050 okay i hope you understood this 
we shall take one more example we shall take an example of 1 0 1 3 into 25 ok so how to proceed with this what we have to do can you tell me first step first we have to divide it by 4 1 0 1 3 should be divided by 4 so what you will get if you divide it by 4 you will get 2 4 2 sir, 2 remainder 253.25 ok you will get 253.25 and this 253.25 should be multiplied with 100 so finally what you will get 25325 ok I hope you understood this 1013 into 25 is 232525 ok 25325 is the answer ok I hope you got this ok now we shall see next set of examples in this we shall multiply with 125 ok we shall take an example we shall take an example of uh, we shall take an example of 73 into 125 ok friends in this case what we have to do is 73 should be uh, divided by 8 ok if you divide by 8 so what you will get if you divide by 8 you will get 9 9.1125 9 ok you will get 9.125 and this 9.125 should be multiplied with 1000 ok so finally what you will get 9125 ok 9125 so let me tell you how I did this 8 ones are and 8 nines are is 72 ok and 1 is remainder ok 1 is remainder and next 8125 ok 1 is remainder and put 1 so 8 1s are 8 ok decimal 1 and again 2 will remainder so 2 is 16 4 will remainder and this will become 2 and 5 so you will get 9.125 ok and this 9.125 should be multiplied with 1000 and finally what you will get 9125 ok so we shall take next set of next example we shall take an example of 117 into 125 so how to proceed with this this 117 should be divided by 8 ok so what you will get if you divide it by 8 you will get 8 ones are 14.625 so you will get 14.625 and this 14.625 should be multiplied with 1000 so finally what you will get 14.625 ok so what is 117 into 125 it is 14625 ok I hope you understood this we shall take one more example we shall take an example of uh, we shall take an example 918 into 125 ok so how to proceed with this what we have to do 918 should be divided by 8 ok so what you will get if you divide by 8 8 10 are 80, 8 11 are 88 ok and this is 14 1 1 4 and this more 0.7 ok so what you will get 114.75 ok and this 114.75 should be multiplied with 1000 ok it should be multiplied with 1000 so finally what you will get 11475 and this is 0 ok I hope you understood this so 918 into 125 is 114750 ok I hope you understood this technique friends now we shall review the techniques that we have discussed so far ok first what we have done we are multiplying with 5 ok in this case what we have done divide this number by 2 and you will get some answer ok and this should be multiplied with 10 and you will get your final answer ok and in next technique what we have done while multiplying with 25 we are dividing that number by 25 sorry we are dividing that number by 4 ok so what you will get you will get one number and that number should be multiplied with 100 and finally you will get one answer ok and finally uh, in final technique what we have discussed while uh, multiplying with 125 ok divide that number by 8 ok and you will get your one answer and this should be multiplied with 1000 ok and you will get your final product ok I hope you understood all these techniques that's all for the session my dear friends if you like this video do click like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel to get notified with my more interesting videos. And also don't forget to share this video. I am Santosh signing off from online studies. Have a nice time. Take care.